All right, so, um, you know, Patty H wants to go ahead and not deny the fact that her husband was an axe murderer, was a brutal murderer, all right? Um, somebody she married ended up becoming, yeah, a murderer, and, uh, I mean, there's really not much much else to be said there. I mean, this is this is somebody who's accusing me of being a demon. This is somebody who makes uh, numerous videos about me, um, says all types of things about me on YouTube on the Pock Lives channel, and which is basically a portal to hell and um, to to the most darkest reaches of hell. And, uh, you know, this, this person wants to make all, you know, make all these accusations at me for, for whatever it is that I've done, but, um, which is all very minor in comparison to her own husband, who was a fucking axe murderer, somebody she married and she opened her legs for ends up being a fucking axe murderer. What about that, Patty? You know, you want to talk about me and what I do all the mean words that I say, you know, and how bad that is, all the things that I say, why don't you fucking get on, on there, on your little soapbox, and uh, with your little channel, and talk about your own fucking husband, your ex-husband, why don't you make videos about him, you want to make videos about me, and oh, he's he's the biggest demon on YouTube, because because he calls everybody on YouTube a demon, big fucking whoop, that, those are words, Patty, I mean, I don't know how old and demented you are, how fucked up in the head that you really are, um, but, uh, you know, um, this ex-husband of yours, I think he deserves, you know, all this roasting you're trying to do on the internet. You Maybe you need to fucking roast him. Why not? You know, um, you're putting up all my mug shots of when the cops fucked with me and, uh, you know what I'm saying, over bullshit, you know, uh, illegally searching me, um, not having any reason to come up to me other than, uh, you know what I'm saying, they, they, they suspected some shit was going on, they suspected I had a little bit of weed, then when they catch me, what do they, what do they catch, you know, not fucking kilos of cocaine, just a little bit of weed, um, so anyways, they've, you know, done all types of illegal shit to me as far as invading my privacy, as far as not having any probable cause, and then they arrest me, and then nothing ever happens in court, they get destroyed in court. So anyways, your bitch ass wants to team up with the fucking police and use the police, um, the police records against me. Wow. What a great truther you are. Damn. I, maybe maybe you're so fucking old and demented you don't know how this truther shit works. Um, truthers don't team up with the cops. All right, so uh, so I don't know what you are. You're just some fucking android demon. That's what I think you are. Uh, you really have like no no soul left. Um, reading your shit is like reading a computer computer program. Something like a you know what I'm saying like you like a if you see two computers talk to each other or whatever, or two computers simulate a computer simulated conversation, that's what the fuck you are. And, uh, yeah, you're soulless and you try to claim Jesus Christ and you try to claim, I mean, I don't see none of that. All right. I don't see no forgiving your enemy. I don't see no loving your enemy. I don't see, um, you know, I, 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 I don't see none of that shit. All I see is uh, some fucking, some, some, some weirdo trying to act like some old lady. Like, I don't know where you got the, these pictures from, this old lady or what the fuck. Um, this bitch be saying all types of shit you'd hear, you'd, you'd expect to hear maybe a 13 year old uh, girl who's like computer savvy and social media savvy and shit to say. And supposedly some old lady rocking a scarf. You know what I'm saying? Um you know, looks like a, a teacher who's about to, um, get their retirement check or something, you know, saying about to retire from teaching or, you know, uh, some real estate, some old real estate woman or some shit. Get the fuck off of YouTube. 
Y'all look stupid as fuck over there on the Pot Lives live stream. I know that's what it's designed for. I know you guys are designed to uh, to just be as ugly as possible and just be the, the, the most lowliest collection of, um, you know, uh, vermin uh, of the earth, you know, all hanging out together and you're just there to just stink everything up, you know, around you. Um, so nobody wants to come around to this sector. I know, you know, you guys are, are gatekeeping like that. You have the fakest motherfucker ever, the the biggest shame to the streets ever, the biggest shame to hip hop culture. Uh, you know, the biggest, the, the, somebody who fronts more than anybody you'll ever see. Um, more than any, any fucking lame ass rapper. All right. That's Pac lives. Um, and you know, I had a video deleted for saying this, but I'm gonna say it again. This is the big den of faggots. It's a big den. Of, I don't know if they're bull dykes or if they're, they're gay men or what the fuck they are. They're not, I, they're, they're not, I don't know what's going on over there, but that shit is, uh, it's really just an embarrassment to the entire world, in my opinion. Um, and, uh, you know, I've had enough of these people. And I, I don't know what it's going to take, you know, um, to get them off YouTube. But, uh, you know, if anybody has any ideas, please let me know. Because um, I just, I can't stand them. They're just, uh, they're just the most vile stench you've ever smelled. Um that live stream is just, it's just so pathetic, and, uh, you know, and YouTube protects this guy, oh, do they protect this fucking little autistic, um, this little autistic, half-retarded, like, mind of a, mind of a stupid 13-year-old, you know, Pac lives, oh, do they protect him, oh, do they delete all types of videos about him, um, you know, and then turn around and, and prop him up and not let him get one single strike. This bitch has made so many fucking death threats. I mean, this shit is stupid. You know, when you sit back and look at everything and all the protection he's getting, it, it's just fucking stupid. I mean, it's just, it's, it's really like a shame to be alive right now. I hate to say that, um, but to have to, to have to like see the world for what it is. Um, and see how backwards everything is, you know, um, it, it really is a shame and there really may be no bigger shame in this world than that Pac lives live stream. Um, it's just the saddest collection, uh, of the most just pathetic souls in the universe. Satan's got them all. He rounded them all up there, you know, um, and, uh, none of them, I don't think even like each other, but. You know what I'm saying? They're being forced to like each other and get along with each other because of Satan. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know, he knows how low down they all are. He knows that uh, they all belong together. Um, and, uh, you know, they're all loyal to him. That's how they got their power. They're too stupid and uh, pathetic and uncreative um, to get that level of power that they've reached on their own. It's just been uh, it's been given to them because they're basically prostitutes, you know, for Satan, they'll do, they'll, they'll, if he tells them to do something, you know, to jump, they'll say how high, you know what I'm saying? Um, and, uh, and that's just, that's just their nature. You know, they're just, they're just that hungry for power, but they can't get it on their own. So they're just ready to do anything. They're ready to do this stupid ass fucking live stream nightly. Um, and just say a bunch of dumb shit on there and uh with their 21,000 subs with their seven people watching get the fuck out of here man y'all is just I mean it, and there it is again you know it's just how stupid is some shit this bitch has four people watching in this shit and supposedly 21,000 people um across the world uh have actually went went ahead and said hey I'm gonna sub to to, to Pac Lives. you know what I'm saying there's all this other shit on YouTube but I'm gonna sub to him and then nothing and then, I mean, you must have the most, either your numbers is fake, which they are, either you're buying subs, which is what it is, or you, it doesn't matter either way, or you have the most, um, 
the, the you you have subs that just absolutely don't give a fuck about you. All right. Um, for some reason. So either way, you're a stack of dog doo doo. Um, it's just like everybody else in that chat room. Y'all are pyramid shaped stack of of dog doo doo. Every one of you, and um, you know, uh, it's just it, it's it's just about time for you guys to be done away with here on YouTube. I mean, uh, nobody likes you. Um, and uh, you know, you're just you're just propped up because Satan needs you so bad. He needs somebody as pathetic. And as fucking uh, lowly as y'all motherfuckers to sit over there, you know, if y'all wasn't so, so pathetic and lowly, you wouldn't have such a nasty ass stench. All right. So he needs somebody, he needs to get y'all all together with your own individual nasty ass stench and uh, sit over there and, you know, say marinate together and just, just stink, stink that area up. Y'all don't have to actually do anything. It doesn't matter if you have seven people watching and three of them are people that hate your guts and are trying to fucking fuck you over somehow trying to figure trying to listen and, and hear hear something where they can use to fuck you over or whatever um <clears throat> you know it doesn't matter because it doesn't it doesn't matter that that you're that nobody even gives a fuck about you because um you're just you're just so fucking disgusting to behold just your presence, just to sit there and look at this guy is sickening. And Satan just loves like shit like that. Like that shit's just easy. Um, so anyways, so yeah, this is just, uh, this is just, just because you guys couldn't do this shit. If you want, if y'all weren't so disgusting, so sickening, so repulsive, um, then this shit wouldn't be. You know that you wouldn't be fit for this shit, but y'all are that nasty. And uh, Pac lives. You ain't gonna do shit. If you were gonna do shit, you wouldn't be sitting up on the fucking internet talking about how you're gonna do shit. You already would have did shit. You already would have ran through. You already would have came through. And you're not gonna do nothing. All right, bitch. I know you're scared. Bitch, you know you'll get fucked up. I don't give a fuck if you have my address. That shit doesn't mean nothing to me. I don't lose one wink of sleep. One wink of sleep. Because you're a little oompa loompa ass and, and worrying about you and all, and all your fucking threats about what you're into. You're not shit, bitch. You ain't going to do shit but drop fucking dead trying to fuck with me. So, um, yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty much the video. Um, you know, these people are just completely full of shit. Uh, they're internet tough guys, tough dykes. I don't know.